everyone my name is Brenda Kaz and on this video I'm going to show you how I did this hair today so I bought this hair from Amazon I'm going to put the link of this hair down below if you want to buy it so it's crochet so I got it to look like box braids so I will also show you how I did that so if you are interested in seeing how I did this hairstyle please keep on watching but before starting the video i will ask you to please like the video subscribe to my channel and click the bell button so you're gonna be notified every time that i post a new video so without further ado let's get into the video so now that i've moisturized my hair i'm going to braid it so i start by splitting my hair in four different sections On this video, I'm going to try a different braid pattern. So I parted my hair and now I'm going to braid this hair and I'm going to do the same thing all over the front section. As you can see, I'm not braiding it all the way to the end. That's because I'm not going to do box braid, so you're just going to see what I'm going to do. So now I'm parting the hair at the back. And now I'm going to cornrow this hair. So as you can see, I'm braiding the hair backward. When I reach the second braid, I tuck it into the cornrow and I do the same for the third braid. And as you can see, it's clearly separated. So I'm going to do the same with this second braid. So I'm starting to braid it backward. And when I reach the second braid, I tuck it into the cornrow and I do the same for the third braid and the fourth one. And now, as you just saw, I link the two cornrow together into one braid. And now I'm going to braid it all the way to the end. And now I'll repeat the same thing all over my head. Now I'm done, but it's not as perfect as I want it to be, but it's fine. And now I'm collecting all of the ends of each corn row to make it into one braid. Now I'm going to tuck the end of my braid into each braid. So here are the crochet braids that I'm going to use. And it comes with a crochet and about six packs of these braids and uh, as you can see the color is beautiful and it also comes with hair jewels so now i'm going to put the crochet underneath my braid and attach the looped end of my braid into the crochet and pull it through my hair and put the crochet through the loop and again and put the ends in the crochet and pull it through and that is a quick tutorial for those who don't know how to use the crochet and if you're a visual learner it's very easy for you to see and recreate it
So now I'm going to do the same thing all over my head. So now I'm done with this side and I finish a whole pack on that side and I'm going to use the second pack for the other side. And now I'm done with the front section, I'm going to the back now. So now I'm using the third pack. And by this time i've already used four packs of crochet braids and as you can see there is a lot of empty spots and i'm going to use the two remaining packs to fill up those empty spots So I used six packs and as you can see it's very full now and uh, I'm really pleased with the result and it's the end of the video. I hope that you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and click the bell button so you're gonna be notified every time I post a new video. I will see you next time. Bye! Mwah.